Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm about to show you how you can fix crashing a loaded screen in GTA 4. I'm gonna share with you what I've tested myself and it worked for me. And uh, make sure you try all the methods I'm gonna show you in this video. There are other methods as well, but I'm gonna show you just what worked for me. And I hope it's gonna work for you as well. Now, uh, make sure you try all the methods and watch this until the very end because I, I don't know which one will work for you. Some methods will work for you, but will not work for others. So, um, make sure you try all the methods and let's jump right into this video without wasting any second. So, the first method, that's very important. Now, go to update. Windows and make sure you update your Windows if you already done that We have to go to advanced options and then optional updates and driver updates And if this list is very huge there are tons of updates available for you To download and install make check make sure you check all the boxes and you click on download and install all right, that's very important and if you Ooh, if you, I mean, after you install all the uh, driver updates, what you have to do that's very important is to go uh, just check the link in the description of this video and you'll find all this website that I have here. Make sure you click and install DirectX and user runtime web installer. Click on the download button. This is what you need in order to run any game, so make sure you install this as well. Also head over to Microsoft Visual C++ and then click and install this as well. Both of this you have or you need on your computer. Now for NVIDIA users you also need GeForce Experience and here in GeForce Experience after installed you have to go in settings and then here in game overlay make sure you turn it off. Also go to drivers. Check if there's any available drivers from here. Check for updates. If you have the latest updates, then uh, you won't find any driver here. This is what you should see. And um, yeah, that's pretty much what you have to do. And now we, we also have to go to graphics settings. And here we have to make sure uh, our Windows will always use high performance for um, you know our graphic card here make sure you also check both of these boxes and from here obviously add your game or locate if you see here the game if you can't see the game you also have you can click on browse and locate the game where exactly go where exactly where you install the game and click uh, select the game so you can add the game in this list just select high performance that's what you need and this pretty much should fix all the problems you have with uh, freezing, crashing and updating screen. Now you can also try to command prompt and run as administrator around this command but this didn't work for me but as I said might work for you. Okay so enter and beginning system scan and uh, wait for the verification to complete and after that make sure you restart your computer thank you guys so much for watching this video and i hope you're gonna have a fantastic day and most importantly i hope now you can uh, enjoy the game thank you for watching and take care